The Maryland State Department of Education put out guidelines earlier this year, and it says it is reviewing the guidance from the feds to see if there is additional information it can give to Maryland school systems. Most local school districts say they will comply with the new mandates from the Department of Education and say they have already made a commitment to make sure transgender students are respected and feel safe in school. Baltimore City Schools say last year all principals attended a training to learn about the rights of transgender students, including allowing them to use the bathroom that corresponds to their chosen gender identity. Howard County Schools say it's about making students feel safe. This is really an individual family issue. It's a privacy issue, just like we work with students on any number of other topics. Um, we work with individual students and families to try to make sure they're safe, respected, supported in their in our school environments. Now, Carroll County school leaders say they have received many phone calls and emails from parents today, and they understand there are strong feelings on both sides of the issue. The school system says it will talk to the State Department of Education, other Maryland superintendents, and its attorneys to better understand the mandate before establishing procedures for implementation. To read the statements about the mandate from each school district, you can head to the WBAL-TV mobile app. Live in the 11 Newsroom, Deborah Wiener, WBAL-TV 11 News.